everyone. Anne here today and uh, this is Anne Makes. So welcome if you are new here. Uh, thank you so much uh, for my faithful followers. <laughs> and if you'd like to subscribe, uh, please uh, do so below. I'd love to have you uh, be a subscriber. So I went to Dollarama and I, it's not a as big a haul as a lot of my hauls are. I know I uh, was in need of retail therapy. <laughs> and um, so this, this is uh, perfect. I got this shopping bag and uh, these are $2.50 a Dollarama. So it's pretty wide, it's pretty big. So I, just, I love what it says, shopping is better than, it's cheaper than chip therapy. I really wouldn't know because I spent all my money shopping, so I don't have any money left over for therapy. Ha ha ha. Um, and I'm going to share with you some other neat little finds that I got today. Like I said, there wasn't a lot, but I, I did good. So the first thing I'm showing you is this It's a Dog's Life. It's a set of it's up it's yeah weekly planner agenda with uh 70 sheets weekly planner 70 sheet memo pad and 210 sticky notes so basically it's a little book like this this is the back and this was four dollars and it has a magnetic little flap here and you open this and what you have inside are these sheets for... <sighs> I would not be making a video without interruptions. It just seems impossible. <laughs> so, where were we? Oh yes, it's a dog's life. And uh, here, so you get this pad of sheets to schedule out your week. And you have this little notepad here. And then you have all these cute little sticky notes and this envelope here to, you know, use for your, your notes, your receipts, coupons, things like that. So keep you organized in a cute fashion all week. I am a cat person, but I do like dogs too. So I just thought this was really, really cute. And if they had a cat one, I would have bought the cat one too. And there were only two on the shelf. There was this one and the other one, which I really wanted to get was the one with the Volkswagen uh, little van. And it was just really, really cute, but it was broken. <laughs> so I, I really would have bought it. I would like, I've liked to have bought it, but I'm not gonna buy something that's broken. So hopefully uh, I can find it at another Dollarama, maybe later this week if I go, back out actually I do have to go back out so I'll I'll look at another Dollarama see if I could find the other notepads uh, here's something that I got and I, oh, I hesitated in getting it because it's so heavy it's heavy it's the Wilton ultimate treat and decorating collection now I thought of some people here who follow me who are uh, cake bakers and I just thought oh I hope this comes to your store because I think you would really like this and how can you go wrong it's four dollars this thing is huge and heavy so it's it's a binder and it's got all these tabs the fighters and yeah I'll show you the sections the different sections that are in there and it's basically it's very it's a very nice binder very nice book so for example, you get ideas for birthday cakes, um, you know, lollipops, and all sorts of treats. Um, the Wilton is the company that specializes in making a bunch of tools and uh, decorations for the, the cake makers. So, yeah. So I bought it, even though I, d I don't seem to be making any more of these uh, decorative cakes. My my kids have outgrown that for some reason, but I thought I can't pass this up. It's such a beautiful book. Um, I had to get it, so I did. 
Another book that I found, and I hope I hope my son will appreciate this. Hope he doesn't find it too childish, but uh, it's Pokemon Go, the unofficial unofficial gaming guide uh, from Tips and Tricks Codebook Magazine. So uh, it's about become a master trainer. So let's take your game to the next level. I'm reading on the back, and this is three dollars. And I thought my my son likes to play Pokemon Go. And he, um, it's, it's one of the few ways that he gets uh, out of the house a lot and he has a lot of exercise. So I just thought, oh, I hope he appreciates this. So I got, I got that for him. And another book that I found, this one is called Market Math. It's a nice cookbook. They had a lot of different cookbooks at uh, my Dollarama and I, I used to collect a lot of cookbooks and I have a lot of cookbooks so I kind of stopped doing that because I just had so so many cookbooks um, so now when if I buy a cookbook it has to be something I already don't have and it has to be very like unique and not expensive so I got this one this one is called market fresh it says 50 ingredients times four recipes four recipes 50 ingredients and equals 200 simple creative dishes so I kind of like that kind of math although I don't like math but this kind of math I do I'm thinking yeah uh, I am I am going to enjoy looking through this book it has amazing photography a lot, a lot of cookbooks have amazing pictures in them, and this one does not disappoint. So I look forward to uh, drooling over the pictures of all the food that's in here. The other thing I picked up were these Command brand uh, refill strips. I could not find any more of co the Command hooks at my Dollarama. And I was kind of disappointed because I'm in need of some hooks. So I thought, well, you know what I'm going to have to do? Um, I was I was going to throw away other hooks that I had. I was just going to peel them off and throw them away. But since I couldn't find more hooks, I thought, oh, I'm happy to find this because now I'll be able to peel off those hooks that I don't need in, in one place and reuse them somewhere else where I do need them by using these refills so this is kind of serendipity for me and you get uh, how many do you get in here you get 12 of the mini eight of the small and four small foam ones in here and it is 250 for the uh, just the little strips that go at the back of the hook so I think that's pretty good this is new at Dollarama. They had just put these out. It is a locker basket with handles. It is by the Studio brand. It says it fits most standard lockers. And it is supposed to be uh, six inches high by nine inches wide by 13 and a quarter inches deep. That's what it looks like. Uh, so this is the the packaging. So it they're sold for use in lockers. Uh, that's really really fun box. They also had the uh, shelves, the stackable shelves to put in uh, lockers with the back to school. I think those are fun to have. But a lot of people have lockers um, either temporary lockers at the gym or they have lockers at work so it's not just uh, kids going back to school that could use stuff for lockers it's it's adults too so and this is what the bin looks like when it's open and uh, I don't have a need for to use in a locker I don't think my son will this year either but I have a closet that has these really narrow shelves and I'm hoping this will fit in that area. If not, it's going to be another bin I'll use elsewhere. But man, I would have liked this when I 
was in school and I had lockers. And they come, the My Dollarama had them in blue and red. This is new at My Dollarama also. It is a package of jute rope, but it is quite thick. There are four meters on here or 13 feet. It doesn't say the thickness of the rope, but it's quite, I don't know if you can see that. It's a very thick rope. And I know that right now it's very trendy uh, in home decor to use a lot of rope like this and even to alter like bins and baskets. This is uh, perfect for that. So I bought a few rolls of it in case I want to do something like that, some home decor with the jute rope. And it's $1.25 for the uh, 13 feet or 4 meters. I got a package of these five metallic tape packs. These are $2 and there is quite a bit on each roll. I just thought I could use this for so many different craft uses, also for gift wrapping, uh, for sending uh, envelopes and just, you know, there's so many. I'm sure there's a lot of uses for this tape. And I had hauled uh, others similar to this previously, but this was the first time I saw this set at my Dollarama with the blue and silver of this little decorative tape. There's not a lot on these rolls though, and these are $1.50, so I bought two. I found some bling, some more bling. It is a uh, trim. It's by Simplicity, so it's a sewing, the sewing notions. There is one yard here, so for Simplicity to have this bling, it is um, very flexible. And I think this was a dollar or a dollar fifty. Yes, so that, these are a dollar, a dollar ramp. And there is one yard on here, or ninety-one point four centimeters. I also got this, it was the only one there, this lonely roll of tape works, silver with the white polka dots to add to my tape collection. Uh, and this was $1.50. Of course, I picked up snacks as I always do for my family. I use the regular snacks that my guys like. They eat the Reese's peanut butter cups, the coffee crisp, these, uh, these sets of 10 usually. Yeah, 10. They're all snack size treats. Oops. Snack size treats of Kit Kat. They're all $2. And a uh, rock star for Hubby. Finally, I want to share with you uh, the Chef Elite fillable tea filters. So basically, these are like empty tea bags that you can fill with your own tea or. Uh, whatever you'd like to put in uh, and just to, to steep in a cup of water <laughs> and there are 25 in here for two dollars and I was just thinking oh I do have some loose tea that would be nice to uh, use in these uh, but it, I also thought these make great little pouches let's see they, they little pouch like this Okay, this is the little empty tea bag and they have a little string with a tag so you can fill it up and then you know close it okay I'm trying to close it you have to pull gently so if you get my idea here so I just thought oh there's some there's some crafty use for these I I know that I have used tea bags, used tea bags in um, some mixed media work in the past, in art journaling too. And I love collecting envelopes and little paper bags. So this will be added to my collection for all my um, art journaling mixed media work. And I will keep a box in the kitchen, of course, too. <laughs> and that's all for. No, that's not all. I took some pictures. I bought a 
set. Well, I bought two uh, three foot high or more plant stands uh, so I could corral my lilies outside because with all the rain we've had, uh, my beautiful lilies that are about four feet tall are like laying flat on the ground right now. So uh, I wanted to get them up, give them some support. So I did that, but I already set those up in the set that up in the garden and so I took pictures to share with you. So uh, those are included. I hope you enjoyed this video. I would so appreciate a thumbs up if you did. Please like, comment, share. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new here. Please come back to watch more videos about my hauls and my crafting videos and my product reviews and a whole bunch of other stuff. And if you have any requests, uh, let me know. And take care of yourself and I'll catch you after the next haul. Thank you for watching. Bye.